Hey guys, welcome to the Dimensions Woodworks Woodshop and today we're going to be talking about the low angle jack plane, the number 62 by Wood River from Woodcraft. Here we go. So I just start by taking everything out of its packaging and then I give it a good wipe to remove the majority of the packing oil. And just a quick eyeball down the sole of the plane and it's nearly a mirrored finish. Then I want to tighten the screws that hold that back handle down and continue to disassemble the plane so I can get into those tight areas and get the rest of the oil from inside of the crevices. So the design of a number 62 plane is a bit different. This is what serves basically as the chip breaker, but is also the toe of the plane. Now for a quick reassembly of all of the parts, and we're gonna check to make sure that our blade is set properly. And I like to test the plain iron without sharpening it at all, just to see how well it cuts from the factory. And you can see here that it's taken some pretty good shavings. So there are a few things that are different in adjusting a low angle plane. This front knob loosens so that you can open or close the mouth of the plane. Then your lever cap doesn't have a spring action, it's got a tightening screw. There's also these slots that correspond with the blade adjustment knob that allow you to slide the blade forward or backward. So living here in Mississippi in a very humid climate, one of the biggest things I battle on my tools is rust. And I'm trying to find a way to prevent the rust from occurring on my quality hand planes that I've gotten. One method that I found that works quite well, but it's a little messy, is Paul Sellers has what he calls a rag in a can. So basically you just take a can, you put some sort of oil on it, and then you use that to rub the surfaces of your tools so you prevent surface rust from building up on those tools. But Wood River has a product for you to help with preventing that rust. So what they've done is developed these silicone impregnated socks for your planes. They're designed to specifically fit the plane that you have. They have them in variable sizes and then you just slide your piece of equipment in there it's got a little drawstring cinch it up tight and now your plane is protected from the elements they come in little packages and these things are great for preventing rust and you don't have to deal with the messiness of the oil everywhere so overall i think that these wood river planes are a great option for middle ground they're not cheaply made but they're not quite as expensive as your lee nielsen and veritas equipment would be these have served the purpose for me and everything that I do in my shop, and granted I am still a hand tool novice, but I think I made a good investment going with Woodcraft and Wood River. Thanks so much for watching guys, and don't forget to get better every day.